I'm going to show you how to create an eBay listing using a custom HTML template. You scroll down to add a description. You're going to see they have two options. One is standard, one is HTML. That's what we're going to use. You're going to need a website that provides you with HTML posts for eBay. If you do a search on Google, you're going to find a bunch of them. There are pretty much two different kinds you're going to find. One is where they provide image hosting up to a certain amount of memory. After that, you're going to have to start paying for them to, to host your images. Another is like freebutiquetemplates.com, where they do not provide image hosting, but they show you how to use your own image hosting. Now this site only provides free image hosting up to 16 megabytes and I'll use that up in maybe four or five listings so this is not a good option for me. That's why I went with free boutique templates. Okay I'm going to choose their first template for an example. All their templates are customizable. You can add your title, your pictures, description, payment terms, shipping terms and they'll give you the code at the bottom of the page. Copy that whole code. open notepad paste it okay go back to your eBay listing these are the standard photos of course that appear at the top of the screen if you do want to add large photos that appear in the description you're gonna need a website to host your photos one I like to use is photo bucket upload all the images you're gonna use including a header image if you want to change the header of your template we're gonna need the codes for all the images Instead of having to click on every picture to get the code, go to update link options, scroll down to easy linking mode and turn it on. Click save. Now all the images have the codes right under them so you don't have to waste your time clicking on every image and then getting the code. You can just get the code copy. They have four different kind of codes. One for email and IM, one says direct, one says HTML, one says IMG. We're going to use direct codes. So you just click on that, copy it. They start in HTTP and they end in .jpg for JPEG. Now you're going to have to learn how to edit your HTML template, which is very simple. Okay, so you see they tell you header is next. This is their header image right here. So if you had your own header image to upload, in between equals and the last arrow that's where you would paste your image see so right after the equals my HTTP starts for my hosted image on photo bucket and after dot JPG that's where it ends so I just uploaded my own header image under that you see title comes next and it's optional the title goes here so go where it says title goes here, change it. Okay, next we're going to add images in the description. If you do not want images in the description of your eBay listing, go to where it says pictures come next and delete it. Let's say you won't have any images in the description. If you do want images, go to, your, go to photo bucket get the direct code for the image copy it go back to your template and paste it after the equals and before the arrow if you want to add another image arrow IMG space SRC equals paste your code again then close it with just make sure all your images come before this this closes all your images after images go to the description if you scroll down you'll find type your description here in between these arrows Next, you're going to find payment terms. And 
Next is shipping terms. And that's it, my template is done. Now what I like to do is I'll save my template now. Now that you have your header, your title, your shipping terms, payment terms, you can save it and use it as a template every time you're going to make an auction. Okay, when you're all done, copy the whole code, control A, control C, go to your eBay listing, paste it here, and preview. You can come and preview it while you're changing it too to make sure you're doing it right. Preview. So preview. There go the images. There's my description, my payment terms, my shipping. Then you would just continue filling out the rest of the information like you normally would. One final trick, to add a YouTube video to your template, go to the video you want to add, click share, embed, these are the newer embed codes, eBay will not accept these, you have to use the old embed code, so check the box, this is the old one, it starts with object, copy that, go to your HTML template, Scroll down right after pictures. Okay, this is my final picture. And after this P right here is where the pictures close. This is where I'm going to add it. And you could change the size right here. After width, you can change the width. Let's make it 600. Get the widescreen effect. By 300 height. Don't want it to take up too much of the page. Let's preview it. There it is. In the uh, years since our book was published, uh, there's probably